this time of year, we oftentimes get questions about controlling weeds in the landscape. And one of those questions that we get a lot is controlling dandelions. It's important to understand the biology of a weed before trying to control it. In the case of dandelions, they are a perennial plant, meaning they grow back from the same plant every year. And the most effective time to control them is when they are taking in nutrients and pulling them into the roots so that they can store them over the winter. So controlling them in the fall after the first hard freeze is the best time to control them. It's also important to try and control them during the summer to minimize their spread and to keep them from taking over your yard. There's lots of products out there that you can get for weed control in your lawn. Make sure that whatever product you select has dandelions listed as one of the weeds that it will control. And make sure that it is labeled for the place that you're going to apply it. If you're applying it to your lawn, make sure that it's labeled for use on your lawn. And also follow other label directions as far as how much to mix, timing of those applications, and other safety factors in order to minimize any unwanted effects of that pesticide application. Many of the products that you will find for controlling broadleaf weeds, such as dandelions in your lawn, include active ingredients such as 2,4-D or dicamba, both of which are very prone to drift, and so you need to be very careful about applying them when there's any kind of wind or when it's too hot and they might vaporize and drift to non-target sites. While summer is the time we usually think about weed control, don't forget that the fall is also an important time to control dandelions. We hope this helps you to be safe and more effective in your dandelion and other weed control in your lawn. And again, always remember to follow all pesticide label directions. This has been Caleb Carter with the University of Wyoming Extension. You're watching from the ground up.